Hello and welcome back to Sarah Reacts. Today we're going to be watching season 1, episode 10 of the Pacific and Wikipedia says this episode is called Home. Yeah, so last episode we ended with them all getting told that they were heading home and they were getting on back onto the trucks and heading back. It was definitely an up and down episode when it came to Sledge because throughout the first half of it he was he was so like angry and just wanted to kill as many Japanese people he said as he want as he could and then he saw more and more of what was happening and he kind of he kind of got himself back in a way he, he held that elderly woman and she passed away which made me tear up <laughs> I was like for god's sake Sarah stop being so emotional <laughs> but I can't help it I always am probably always will cry at emotional parts in shows <laughs> but yeah enough chattering let's get into it Phantom Blondie. Too fair. The Japs surrender. The war's over. Ah, uh, surrender day. The war's over. Oh, uh, so they're not home home yet. I like how he's gone to a, a, uh, a pipe now instead of smoking his cigarettes. <laughs> Is this Lena? Do we get to see her again? Oh, it is! I thought you should have this. What is it? Oh, his medal. Thanks. Thank you for doing all you did to keep us from getting that full head shot off. Yeah, how'd you even say goodbye? They're good Marines. We're all mighty proud of you. Proud of all you soldiers. Well, it's where Safi gets up. Is he gonna go without saying goodbye? No. Last time I saw you was in church right before you shut down. So you look well. Nice uniform. Did she not get any of his letters? You want to take me out? Yes, I do. <laughs> uh, he I wasn't really think. writing them to her, <laughs> was he? Oh. Nice car. Maybe tomorrow night. <laughs> What's going on here? Well, I just asked her if she'd like to have dinner. Nice try. If she's not interested. She's gonna say she is, isn't she? <laughs> Actually, I don't have any plans for tomorrow night. Oh, is that right? Really? It's not very healthy for dinner tonight. I will not cry. <laughs> You're gonna pass on your own end ball? No. I don't believe I will ever put on a uniform again. Oh. Ew. 
I mean, he doesn't want to wear the uniform anymore. Does he want to carry a gun? Yeah, he's breathing hard, it says. I don't think he'll have a very good reaction if he hears the guns. Nothing to be sorry about, Eugene. That wasn't a good idea. Oh, PhD in biology? It's a career teaching me. The older pictures, so I'm guessing that they've like interviewed them and stuff. Yeah, so that was season one, episode ten, the finale of the Pacific. That was such a good show to watch. I really appreciate the end because sometimes some shows try and go like out with a big bang, and it's just unnecessary. So I was a bit surprised. It was a bit of an abrupt ending, but I do appreciate that it was slow. And you, you know, I mean, some people that came back immediately obviously would have got like big welcome back parties but these guys some of them stayed a bit after so they got a more quiet subdued like welcome back and I can't believe uh, Snafu didn't speak to anyone for 35 years <laughs> you know but first off sneaks off while Sledge is asleep and then radio silence <laughs> no that was a really good series I'm really happy I watched that and uh, thank you for watching it with me <laughs> So for the Bandelli Access, it's available on patreon.com forward slash Sarah Axe.